Hey, what's up guys? It is Dan Lags, and I am back again for another Let's Build for you guys today. And in today's Let's Build, I am going to be doing a fighter jet. So I've been getting a lot of recommendations to do a jet or an airplane or something like that. So I decided to do a fighter jet because these are pretty awesome. And uh, here's my design. I tried to use as many of the like the new materials I've gotten in uh, the TU-14 update as I could. So I have like cobblestone walls, quartz, and things like that. So carpets a little bit on the top here. So guys, we're going to go ahead and build this. It shouldn't be too... It's a little bit tricky. kind of looks a little bit complicated, and especially in the back here. But uh, we'll do our best to, I guess, you know, uh, do a little let's build of it for you guys today. So you can add to your world and stuff like that. So I'm just going to go ahead and break all of this just to get like a platform for me to start at. So these are some upside down quartz slabs to start. I'm actually going to go ahead and place a full block underneath and then make just, whoops, I just screwed that up. Do I have the mod on? No, I don't. Okay, so I'm going to go like that. There we go. So from here, I'm going to take it out six blocks. Actually, well, hold on. We already have two. So I'm going to take it out three or four more. I think I'll take it out three more. So one, two, three. And then from here, I'll take it out two. And then from here, I'll take it out two more. Just like that. So we kind of have like the curve of the plane to get started with. I'm going to play some quartz blocks like this, three blocks where, uh, you know, right next to the slabs we have. And then back here, I'm going to place two. And then up here, I'm going to place three. So one, two, three. Oops, three. I'm going to place some more slabs right here. So we have a total of five here. And then this back uh, quartz lining here is eight. From back here, I'm going to place two more quartz slabs like that. Just the regular ones, not upside down. Back here, I'm going to place a quartz stair like this. And then go like that. So as you can see, this is going to be the front and that is going to be the back just in case you kind of have your uh, bearings all mixed up right now. But, you know, it's going to start to make sense very soon. So next thing I'm going to do is place a block of full quartz right there. Then I'm going to place some stone slabs like that. Just make it a full block. And then another stone slab block like that. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to place two quartz slabs right there to make that a uh, couple full blocks just like that. Looks good. Next thing I'm going to do is place two more, or I guess another uh, full block of quartz here, and then place a quartz slab on top. We're going to follow that up by placing three blocks of glass, just like that. And then we're going to place another full block of quartz. So we should have three blocks of glass and then a full block of quartz. And then we can take back the slabs, three more, just like this. Then I'm going to place some carpets on top. So I'm going to place carpets one, two, three, and then one off the edge just to make it look a little bit more aerodynamic. Why not? So now that we have kind of like one side of the plane almost finished, what I'm going to do is I'm going to place uh, a couple more slabs. So I'm going to place one, two, three, four, and five, just like that. And we're going to do the same thing on the other side. So one, two, three, four. Uh, that actually, hold on a second. I think it's just four. Uh, if I'm not, yeah, it is just four. All right, cool. So just four. And then in here, I'm just going to place some upside down slabs like that. Or actually, sorry, some regular slabs like that. Just so we have like a little bit of space here in the cockpit. Okay, cool. So now what we have to do kind of is just copy and paste it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to place my slab, like, or not slab, stair. I, I mix that stuff up a lot. It's hard to uh, place blocks and say the names, apparently, for me. <laughs> so we got a block of full quartz right there. And then we just kind of, kind of have to copy and paste the design. So we have the wing over here, which is just going to go like this. And we're just going to take this blocks, these blocks of quartz out. So we have uh, two already. So we go three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. And then we're gonna do the wings. So we come two blocks away from the stair, start right here. And uh, actually, sorry, I think it's only one block away. Yeah, it is, I don't know why I'm messing up so much. So two, three, four, and five. And then we can take this out a few blocks and then you just start to fill it in one by one. So we're gonna go like that, take another two, and then one. And then right here, we're just gonna place them upside down like this, just to make them look a little bit more aerodynamic. And there we go, we have the two wings. Now we just gotta add these full blocks here just to kind of add like kind of a smooth transition into the actual part of the, you know, the plane. So next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start working on the back here. This part's a little bit tricky, so just bear with me. Um, we're gonna place two quartz blocks right there, quartz stairs, and then we're gonna place a couple upside down quartz stairs like that. We're gonna place a couple off to the side like this. And then we're gonna place our uh, quartz slabs like this and like this, whoops. And then what we want to do is just place them above that like this and one more like that. And then all you have to do is just replace this. Actually, hold on. Is it even like, I think it is, um, let's see, did I even do that right? I don't, I don't know if I did. Uh oh, oh wait, oh wait, yes I did, yes I did. All I have to do is just place the slabs here instead of the regular blocks like that, I believe. And then you can break these slabs there and that looks to be correct. I'm just, this part's a little bit tricky, so you're gonna have to bear with me. I believe I do have that correct. Again, I suck at copying my own stuff, apparently. 
Okay, so we're going to go ahead and place some full blocks of quartz just like that. And then we're going to place two blocks of quartz slabs back like this. And then underneath of that, a couple of stone slab blocks right there just to add a little bit to the back. All right, cool. So next thing we're going to do, we're going to come under here and we're going to place a little bit under here just to kind of make it, you know, a little bit more making sense under here. So there we go like that. And then we can add a little bit more. I think it comes up to like right there. And then this block right there can be broken and we can place our anvil. So what I need to do is place two blocks of string here and then break the first one and then place our anvil. And that's going to act as the, um, you know, kind of the landing gear, I guess, like the uh, wheels. So I'm going to place a couple more right here. So string and string and then another string. Then you just want to break the first string and place the anvils. You can use just like regular bedrock or whatever tires, but I, I like to use the anvils. I'm not really sure why. I just do. Okay, so next thing we're going to do is we're going to place three more blocks of quartz slabs like this, and then three more in the middle like that, just to kind of add a little bit more to the belly of the plane. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. I actually don't even think we need one like right here. Maybe not. I'm not sure. Let me check the actual uh, design just in case. Looks like... Um, According to this, I guess we have four. So it's kind of tricky. I don't even know how this works. Did I do this wrong? Um, it looks like I, oh, I know what I did wrong. Man, I'm sucking at this. Uh, yeah, I have to place the, the anvils right here. I don't even know how to build this thing. I probably should have like looked over it a little bit more. All right. It's hard to copy designs a lot harder than I thought it would be. All right, so I'm going to place these here like this and like that. And then I can break the front strings. All right, so we got to... Okay, now I got to place these here like this and like that and then like that. All right, there we go, guys. Kind of have that a little bit more straightened out now. Sorry, that was so confusing. So I'm just trying my best here. All right, so we're almost done with the jet. All I'm going to do now is just add some cobblestone walls here. So I'm going to place like four coming out from like the first, I guess, uh, three blocks here. And then I'm going to place another one right here coming out four blocks and then on this back one here i'm going to place a upside down stone slab and i'm just going to put like a full block of stone slabs like that as well so i'll do the same thing on the other side just go like this it's pretty easy to do this part just place the stone walls and uh, the cobblestone walls so just kind of act just like the i guess the gunner part of the uh, fighter jet but guys that's pretty much it that is the fighter jet complete a little bit tricky to build but hopefully you guys could follow my uh, really really silly tutorial because I kind of suck at this kind of stuff. But guys, I still like the design. I think it's pretty cool. Um, you know, it's kind of like pretty good size. It's not too big, not too small. But it, I think it works pretty good, to be honest. So hopefully you guys liked it. Hopefully you guys uh, build this in your world. I want to see you guys sending me some pictures of it. That would be awesome. You guys have been sending me pictures of uh, you guys adding my other vehicles and stuff like that to your world. So hopefully you guys like this one as well. If you guys want me to keep doing these, I will gladly do them. And hopefully my... my uh, ability to i guess build it again will will improve obviously over time but guys thank you very much for watching it has been your friendly neighborhood dan like so hope you guys like it i think this is a pretty cool design and uh, again hope you guys build it in your world but guys thank you very much for watching be sure to click the like button if you did enjoy it subscribe if you're new all that stuff it has been your friendly neighborhood dan Lags, and i'll talk to you guys on the next one but until then guys have a good day and peace out